Hello YouTube, it's me again. Hope everybody's doing okay today. I'm trying out my new pan that I got for Christmas. My red copper pan. I'm just cooking up a couple of hot dogs. I hate cooking indoors, but I have to try this pan. Talk about non-stick. Check this out. Watch this. <laughs> if anybody's ever tried to cook a hot dog in a pan without any oils or anything else, you would know that it is very difficult because it likes to stick to the pan. But this pan, if you season it correctly, and you do have to season it, um, you have to put a thin coat of oil on it, and you have to bake it in the oven at 300 degrees for 20 to 30 minutes. I let it go for 30 minutes, and normally... This is what my non-stick pans look like after I get done cooking in them. They're not very non-stick, are they? I have to still scrub that one out. That's from last night. I didn't feel like doing any dishes last night. But this pan, these hot dogs are not even attempting to stick to it at all. In fact, I can't even get them to stay in the middle of the pan so they'll cook. They just slide everywhere. And I haven't put any oil or anything in there. You can see the pan is dry. I did cure it uh, yesterday in the oven like I was supposed to, and I decided, you know, instead of doing the whole, <laughs> instead of doing the whole coffee pot trick with boiling and, you know, cooking hot dogs in the coffee pot, I wanted fried hot dogs today, and uh, I got me some uh, <clears throat> microwavable mashed potatoes here that I'm going to throw in the pan here shortly, and and uh, I'll show you that here in a few minutes. All right. All right, YouTube, here we are again. Still not using any kind of butters or anything else in the pan. And as you can see, it is uh, non-stick. <laughs> Nothing is sticking. It's not st sticking to the pan at all. Um, this is just those microwavable potatoes that I showed you a second ago. And uh, I can. Uh, the thing I like about this is on the commercials they always showed you could use metal in them, and I have tried to scratch this pan, and it's it don't scratch. So I mean, at all, it doesn't scratch, which is awesome. Uh, when I'm done, all I'm going to have to do is wipe it out and put it away, and and uh, use it again the next time. Um, this is pretty awesome. There's my hot dogs done. I'm just warming up these microwavable mashed potatoes because I don't want to. Uh, my microwave's broke. So it just stopped working all of a sudden. I don't know why, but it did. And so right now I'm just warming up these potatoes. I can't wait to cook some bacon and eggs in this damn thing. I tell you, I just can't wait. Uh, I just didn't happen to have any bacon and eggs today, but this is the red copper pan that you see on TV, advertised on TV, and it's everything they said it was for the first time ever. I got something that was advertised properly. <laughs> Definitely a good pan, and you know how sticky mashed potatoes can be. All right, well, that's it for today. Have a great day. Uh, keep smiling, keep trying, and never give up.